Okay, we're getting close now. Uh, this is the uh, first RF stage, and uh, tomorrow we'll be uh, firing it up and, uh, and playing with it. Uh, for this stage, we're going to be mounting two ICs, and note that, pull back a little bit, uh, this is the way the board looks now, and we have just one stage to go up here, the RF2, and then final assembly. But uh, these two ICs, make special note, they go upside down, okay, so that the notch faces the right, okay. The NE592, you may get one that says UA733. It's the same chip. You may get an NE592, you may get an UA733. Uh, They're both the same. This is an SA602 right here. And after you put that, uh, this put this IC in first, and then put these resistors. There's two 750 ohm resistors here, and that's uh, let's see, 750. That's purple, green, brown. Don't confuse it with the other one single, re the other resistors that are in here. This is a 680 that looks similar, but these two are both 750s. This resistor here is a 4.7K, that's yellow, purple, red. Then another yellow, purple, red uh, 4700 goes here. And then an 047 capacitor goes here. Two little 470 picofarads go here and here. A jumper goes here. A uh, 220 microfarad filter goes here. Make sure the negative is to the left. Make sure you don't get these big ones in backwards. They pop if you do. You're going to put two diodes in here, right above this capacitor. One faces up, one faces down. Right above that, is a, or to the right, is a jumper. And then right above that is another 10 microfarad electrolytic, uh, minus to the left. There's a 220K resistor that goes right here, right next to this pin 2 of the IC. Then another 10 microfarad with a negative also facing up. Then there is a 680 ohm resistor right here and a 10K resistor right here, that's brown, black, orange, then a jumper, then there's one, two, three, four, uh, 56 picofarad capacitors and an unused hole, note the unused hole. There's a 001 capacitor here, another 102 capacitor. Right here are two 270 microhenry coils, and they go right into those holes right there, a jumper right there, a jumper right here, and the last part for this stage is the uh, 102, it's labeled 102, it's a 1K pot, that's the RF gain control. You will have to, with needle nose pliers, bend these leads carefully out, then back down to fit the, uh, to fit the holes. And then that's it for RF stage 1, and then as I say, tomorrow we do RF stage 2, and then we put some power to it and fire it up, see how she works.